All right, tarot cards, let's do this. So the way this game works, you start a little island here. You can buy more islands, kind of like with Forger. You get your cards here and you can place down things like wheat. And wheat costs money to place down, one gold to place down, and costs a maintenance cost of uh, water every turn. And we don't want to run out of water. That would be bad. And the production, the water well costs 10 gold a turn. So I'll be it, like, there's a maintenance cost right here. It's also day one. The purpose of the game is to pay off your debt. I, right now, it's uh, 100 gold due in nine days, and then it becomes more and more, and eventually I think you pay off your debt entirely and you win. And if you end a turn on negative money, you lose. If you can't pay your debt, you lose. So that's your win-loss condition. You expand more islands, the things interact with each other. And when you uh, end your turn, and like say I, I end my turn, I produce wheat, it will get stored here and I can sell it for some money, or I can like put some cows down, the cows would eat the wheat and produce milk. And also there's like, this is all the cards I have. Here's like the crops, here's the animals, here's the structures. And here's where I can look things up like, oh, okay, what does carrot do? Here's a carrot, it costs water to maintain it. And then it makes water, uh, it makes the animals nearby islands cheaper to use. It's a pretty cool, neat game. And I need you need to plan out what you want to do. Do I want to be the cow to be on the same island as this? Do I want the cow to have its own island? You have to have, the cow has to go within a fence. The fence costs five gold a turn to maintain. So it's going to be a little bit expensive, but we get things cooking here. So I'm going to put down, I think we do. Also, these things affect each other. So my production of crops goes up if the water well is on the same island. So we want to put water wells on the same island as our crops. Also, if you put four crops together in a little square, it doubles the production even more. So I could get more wheat in the same island. Be useful. I think I'm going to do the cow on the adjacent island. Hold this down to trigger that and recenter myself a little bit. We'll put a fence right here like so. If I can click it properly and put the cow in there as well and cow takes up three of those tiles there's only seven or ten spots left there it takes three water to maintain it i'm still saving five a turn you use two there three there we're doing great and we will end our turn some of the wheat goes to feed you and the rest goes into here and we got some milk so i got nine profit off of the day i could sell that if i want to um but we'll we're fine on money right now gotta make sure we don't run out though if this number is higher than this at the, and you click end turn, uh, you lose. <laughs> so don't do that because this is how much it costs to maintain your stuff every day. And also every few turns, you get like new cards and stuff added. Do I want to, another water well? Here's the thing. Another water well would double the production of my crops by two. So I'd be making an extra two gold a turn, but it also cost me an extra 10 gold a turn. So it's actually a net loss of eight gold a turn. So I don't think I want another water well right away. I think the problem also we stream this live. I played it for like 13 minutes off this video here, and oh boy, <laughs> it took me took me a hard time to figure out that you can just sell stuff right here. I was confused, looking like an idiot. Better watch the video, right? Um, let's see, like seeing things live. Put the wheat down here. Increases it costs money here. Doesn't cost any more maintenance, but now that should double it because I have four grouped up, right? Or maybe not. Thought it was supposed to. And put some more wheat down here. And now at the very least it should be 10. Although I think it's I think it's something about doubling them, right? Tell them this is live like you did. I just did. And water well. Uh, do I put another cow down? Yes, because the cows, yeah, like one wheat becomes one milk effectively via the existence of the cow. So you like six times the value of your wheat, which is really good. So we want as many cows as we can get. They do cost a lot of water, though. I will need to keep the water up on them. I don't mind losing. I can do that for five turns for the amount of water. I'm not going to put this down because it costs 10 gold to maintain it. So we end our turn and we lost 15 gold there. But every third turn we get like a card and we get some rerolls here so i can uh, get a sunflower or another or i could get four i think this is like the number of cards so i could get four more water well cards i get 12 more sunflower cards I get 19 corn cards i think this is how much it costs to play so sunflowers are kind of expensive to play corn's a bit cheaper sunflowers the way they work is they get plus the production there's no structure in one island range so what counts as structures so these are so a fence is a structure is the water well structure? Yeah, yeah, the water well structure. So both my islands have structures on them right now. But these guys right here, so I'd have to build a few more islands. I don't really have the money to do. I guess I could sell stuff. But uh, they get plus your production, so it's pretty good. And adjacent islands use crops that use energy. I don't have that, but I could get good production on them. Or I could go for the corn, which gets plus your production if there's only corn on the island, which seems pretty doable. And plus 10 production per adjacent island with 16 corn. So if you if you go corn, you really want to go for corn. You want to put an entire island of corn and then put another island next to it that's all corn. It, and the thing is about the corn is they cost two water each, which sounds like a lot of water. 
you use one water each and you give sunflower seeds, but I want, you know what, I want corn. Uh, chat saying corn, we're doing corn. Corn boys, we're, we're the corn boys. Yeah, chat's all about the corn, so we're going corn, all right. That's why it's fun to do it live. So I think we can do it over here. I need to, I, I should probably sell, so we should probably, we got a lot of money there. We need to make some money. Give that, you can also put that automatic selling if you want to. I'm putting on manual because I don't know if I should be waiting or something. I can fit one more count to this. Thank you. And now we're getting uh, even more milk, which is great for money. And we're going to need another island for the corn boys once I start drawing them. Prices go up as you go more out, more and more. I'm liking this game so far. Now I know how to do it. Thank you, chat, for explaining it. I had I couldn't figure it out. Chat had to tell me, you sell here, you idiot. <laughs> go to the market. All right. And we, we're going to need some more water. Our water situation is not great. Uh, this is the corn island. I'll put the wheat down here. And let's put another water well. I'll, that'll cost me 25 gold. I'll still have... We won't go bankrupt, so you can go here with the wheat boys. Like so. Are these things giving me extra wheat? How much... Let's see. If they're not getting wheat from being grouped up, it'd be 12 minus 3 is 9. But if I'm getting double for having a batch of 4, should be more. I'm not sure. Do I want this? No, we, we ignore these. And... Do they give me extra? They are doing the thing where, like, since they're grouped up, they're getting extra value. Okay. That was something that explain the tutorial. Alright, all the corn boys. The corn boys are here. There we, there we go. Alright, so how did it work again? Let's put you over here. Yeah. And it gives plus two. Wow, ah, what's this? I'm sorry that's so loud. I need to turn that volume down. Nice. Melix just became a member. Hey, make more corn islands. I'm all about I, corn boys. I'm in. Thanks so much for uh, becoming a member. Appreciate that. No, for re-upping your membership. Appreciate that. Thank you for the five months. Sorry. it's uh, It's been a while since I streamed. We're, we're rusty. All right. Thanks so much. We'll get the corn over here. Ah, no, no, no. Negative five. Wait, do I have to, please? Oh, thank you. <laughs> you don't want to see that. Okay. We're good. We're good. Um, I can put down one more and not be broke. Um, 29, we can't put down ammo. If I put down one more, we will lose, so. We end it, we lose at 25, I got four bucks left. I need to sell this right away. Six corn. The corn is worth three each, and they give two each. The corn's pretty good, that's, that's, that's a hefty chunk of change right there, that's pretty nice. Loading the corn, lover's clan. I have, I can't fit any more cows in there, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Um, we're gonna need water, another water well soon, I think. But we do, right now, we are the corn boys. Give me corn, good. Make sure we can afford all this. I got 20, yeah, we're fine. Water situation. We probably put in more put more water down. Right? If I put down this, it'll be 35. I'll have 36. That's fine. That's that's good. We'll be one gold left here after that. I kind of wish this was somehow like tallied in this, like somewhere on the screen. It would just show me like, you know. Yeah, it's fine. I'm nitpicking. We're about to outcorn the northwestern states, they say. All right. Oh, you save your rerolls over time, I think. That's neat. We could get more, 10 more wheat if I want to commit to the wheat. Water chicken. It costs 20 gold. What are you all about? What do you do? Lays, it was weird to start to scroll down, but whatever. Lays water egg producing 20 water per egg. So it's a way of getting water. That's kind of neat because then you don't have to pay the upkeep costs for water wells. That's interesting, although it costs 20 gold to buy the thing. But a water well costs me 10 gold every turn for each one I have, so it's kind of expensive, right? Lays water egg producing 20 water per egg, plus 20 water if water egg is hatched. So they, when they lay it, 20 water. If it hatches, another 20 water. Occupies one slot, okay? Um, so you could fit you could fit 10 of them in a fence. You could fit 10 water chicken chicken in a fence. That's really good. But you have to feed it corn, so that is effectively. You're so you're paying you're still paying effectively because that corn corn sells for three gold of corn right so you're paying three gold a chicken but you get that's that's three gold to get one water egg that's three gold a turn to get twenty water that seems like a really good deal that seems that seems very very good but check out the peanuts first though also you can click this see behind uh, what are you all about you guys produce oh we can start getting fuel though. We can start getting fuel, fuel peanuts. You literally grow your fuel. It produces three fuel for every production. Okay. So how do you gauge production? Cost two fuel gives fuel peanuts. Adjacent island peanut cow eat it, making it use fuel instead of water. This is getting complicated. So you plant fuel on one island, peanut cows on the island next to you eat the 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 eat eat the fuel. Eat it, and and then they 
and then the peanut cows, instead of using water to fuel the peanut cows, keep them alive, you use fuel to keep them alive. It so what does this cost to fuel? Does that mean it costs to fuel to make it, or is that like it's maintenance costs? That's his maintenance costs. So, so, okay, so, so you, I need to have a fuel source to maintain the peanuts. And then the, the peanuts will produce three fuel. So you have to have fuel to make, you know, we're, I think there's a whole other run that can be done with, uh, with uh, peanut fuel, peanuts and peanut cows. We're water chicken boys. We're water chicken boys. We'll do peanut cows in a different run. I think we are water chicken boys. So we're doing. And now we do our, our turn here. Turn here. All right. So you will go there. Oh, oh, pay attention to money. Pay attention to money. I should almost just, I'm tempted to put that on auto. What else am I saving it for, right? I think, I think once it's in your market, I'm, I, you can't even, I'm not sure you can use it for anything else. I don't know. Maybe you can. I don't know how it works. We're learning the game together. We put down the corn. We're the corn boys. We have a lot of money. Remember, we got to pay this every four days, but I think corn is going to make us very wealthy. Negative water income. I'm not all about that life. Let's put this down, like, right there. There we go. And now we're doing better. Although we're spending... Uh, maybe I shouldn't put down the water wells, because I'm about to be doing the water chicken meta. I think... How many did I get? One? You would actually fill up the last slot in there. That's great. You cost 20 gold. Sell this right away. Ooh, so much money. We're getting rich. Corn's making us a lot of money. You will lay water eggs for us. So we put you in here. And it just says... It just up to 20... Just increases my, my water... Income by 20. And why is it like off screen? Slide, can I like click and drag? No, we just gotta like slide WSD. It, so you cost, you cost one production. Does that mean, does he cost wheat? I wasn't paying attention. Whatever. Um, what did, what does the old water chicken cost? One corn, that's right. You cost one corn. All right, so I wish I told you what. Yeah, gotcha. All right, and I should probably put a fence down now while I have it, because I imagine I might get more water chickens in the future. Do the water fish in... Do they need to be adjacent to anything? Do you care about being adjacent to anything? No, you don't. So I'm going to toss you all the way over here where it doesn't really seem to matter. We'll put a fence over in there. And then corn boys will continue the corn boy mission over here for extreme corn wealth. There we go. Water chicken boys assemble. Water chicken is broken. Maybe, maybe not. It depends how... Ex like, these games are designed to scale a lot of times. So if it gets real expensive... Um, maybe it's perfectly balanced. Oh, I had, I must have had quite a few of them. All right, so, well, gotta get the corn down. So I'm more concerned with corn right now. Like, I have a surplus of water. Can I sell these? No, I wish I could. Maybe there's a way to destroy things later I'm unaware of. And I need to have 50. Also, I, I have, yeah, oh, I have extraordinary wealth. So far, I'm thinking you could probably turn that on auto sell and get away with it, but I'm not sure yet. You know, this, we're doing, it's probably supposed to be easy the first few days because it's, yeah, let's put these boys down here and... Water is just a non-issue for now, but we'll need more and more water, right? All right, so what do we want? Probably more corn. Uh, small fences, I'm all right, I think. I could get regular chicken. I can make drunk chickens. If it's chasing the blue wheat, I can make, you can make blue wheat, apparently. Use energy set of water. Um, gives eggs. I don't think I'm worried about it. I, I mean, it does eat corn, but why would I go for chickens when I can get more corn? There's, like, why would you want like corn when you get more corn because these cards like yeah, yeah they get there we go there we go uh all the extreme wealth we're building up yeah we got a strong build here and they get value for being the value yeah post production is only corn on the island 10 production per adjacent island with 16 corn on it so like my corn like my corn production is going to be absolutely crazy from these guys over here extreme corn production i've got is that one day meaning it's gonna be today i could do i put a cow in here I mean, it's more, it is more money, right? Also, it maybe like cycles my draw better. I'd leave the auto sell off for now, I think. All right. Yeah, we got two water chicken now. We're going crazy. I want plus 44 water. We're drowning in water. Can I sell surplus water? All right, let's, uh, do I zoom out a little bit here? Kind of like it zoomed in, honestly. It go like this. Hello, what a great day to charge taxes. Your month's debt is 100 gold. Pay. Now it's 300. See, we need this extreme wealth coming because it just gets more and more expensive. All right. And, oh, oh look at this corn, though. Look at this. Uh, we get a hundred corn. <laughs> we get a hundred corn last time. That's a lot of corn. How much corn are we going to get this time? Just drowned me in corn cards. We have so much money. The maintenance cost is starting to seem relatively minor compared to how much wealth we're making. 
maintenance ain't that bad. After all, that's a lot of corn I'm witnessing. How much corn do we get that time? 171 corn. Just those eight gave me 71 more corn. The power of cornception. You want to be surround. You want like a plus of corn to get really maximum value. I think. I mean, it seems pretty simple. Like my choice is to put down a lot more corn. I think we've found a strong, broken, overpowered corn build already. Maybe have we broken the game already, or is it just going to get crazy, crazy hard? All right. So we have fuel wheat, and once we do more than just corn, if you insist. Fuel wheat produces five fuel. I think this is how you start going down the fuel route. It costs water, gives fuel wheat, okay. Apple tree, plus one production to itself, and various cow types. Does that include default cows? It looks like it. More production to itself, so you get more milk out of apple trees, give more, so it gets two apples by default, I guess, and you get more milk from the cows, and Plus two water cost to each cost on decent islands, but I have the water chicken, so it's not that big deal. It does cost four or water. It's very water intensive. So that is an option. Okay. I'd rather get the fuel wheat started. You do need peanuts to make the peanut cows, but to get anything going at the start, you need the fuel wheat, I think. I think we need a, some fuel wheat island going here. So you guys, do you matter? Produces five water where I put you. Cost five fuel, cost one water, cost fuel wheat. Um, gives fuel wheat. I think we just take the fuel wheat, right, chat? I mean, I'm seeing peanuts, but because you guys want the peanut cows, but I would like to remind you that in order to make the, the there, there's a synergy that goes between the two, like, if you want the fuel peanuts, you have to have fuel to make them. So to get it going, we need fuel wheat, and then we'll come back for peanuts later, so we'll get them again. Get the fuel wheat here, executive decision, and we're good here. We sell all this, because 242 corn, just absolute extreme wealth. Incredible. And... Now that we, that these things don't really matter where I put them. So what I can use, I can use them as like s space filler over here. Although they get more value over here. Maybe I can put a water well over there in the future, I don't know. But yeah, they get value if you group them up, right? Maybe those two are a mistake, I think it'll be okay. Seems to be kind of forgiving so far. The corn is extreme. 1600 gold, I'm wealthy beyond all belief. Buy more islands, they're so cheap. Eventually, honestly, you're right, but... Maybe I should just have them dedicated to their islands, but like, I feel like conserving space could be good, but I mean, you're right, maybe they're so more valuable in focusing on synergy. For this run, I'll focus on space conversation, con conservation, but in the future, you might be right, just having dedicated islands to certain things might be the way to go. Um, anything to sell here? Nope. All right. There we go. We're so rich. Melter. Cost 35 fuel. Repair 30. Ah, this is, and this is why you don't manually sell everything because what if you need your fuel right so this ooh, it turns things into things okay so corn gets turned into things milk it's okay you pro it's a it's a processor blue wheat though if fed to a chicken it gives an electric egg i mean we got to get electricity going right we got to get electricity going right if fed to a chicken it gives an electric egg and 40 energy Plus one energy per adjacent island sunflower. Cost one energy gives blue wheats. So we feed it the chicken. Do I have a default chicken? I don't, I, don't, I don't have default chickens to feed it to is the problem. Um, But maybe I get them in the future and that's how I get my energy, right? Pre prep for the energy future. Or just get the chickens right now to get some eggs. The eggs. I mean, let's just get the blue wheat going. Let's get the blue wheat going. Ah, but the melter seems rare. Get the blue wheat going. Get the blue wheat going. And I think you guys are right. I might have to start doing my own islands. Um, let's do it away from the corn things, because corns can synergize with each other. So, get a new island over here. If they keep staying cheap, we might as well just have everything dedicated to their own islands, get the synergy going. Oh, that was... Wait, that's fuel wheat. Crap. That was blue wheat. Fine. There'll, this'll be a fuel wheat island down here. I'm sure we'll get more fuel wheat in the future. Here we go. These ones are here just like will be a mistake of the past. A vestige memory of learning. That's so much money. Can I, like, choose what I sell? Oh, I see. Oh, I, okay. That's what I do. It's two. Okay, gotcha. So you can click everything but the fuel wheat. Makes it. Okay. Vibe check question mark? The vibes are great. I'm having a great time. V amazing vibes because we're playing a fun little game, actually. All right, that goes there. And blue wheat can chill uh, over here, I think. You are my water chicken, boys. Blue wheat over here. There we go. My water is actually getting a little bit of a low side, but we're doing fine. And we keep the fuel. I can sell this other stuff. 
um, milk, sure, water, egg, uh, sure, it's fine. And then we go on our merry way. Oh my goodness, the corn. We're, I think I do agree that we need more corn, but the game's not giving me more corn to put down, unfortunately. So we'll have to wait and we'll do other things. Fuel wheat, more fuel wheat, thank you. And blue wheat. Um, yep, yeah, let's keep stacking that up as well. If fed to a chicken, I don't think we need to store that though. We'll produce more if I just need the chickens to feed it too, right? And we keep the fuel and all this other stuff we sell. Get it out of here. Boom. And done. And we're just saving up lots. Do I need to save the fuel weeds? Or, or does it automatically turn into fuel? I'm confused. I have 103 there. Uh, and they're turning. What do you want here? Fuel corn? I mean... We, it does fit the corn theme, but like we already have enough fuel because it, it's fuel corn. It's not the true corn. Do we really want to have the tainted fuel corn? It produces fuel, but it doesn't actually synergize with the corn that we have. It produces five fuel. It produces 20 fuel if melted on melter. It costs five water. gives fuel corn. But the problem is that doesn't, we, we, we have, I, we already have enough fuel. I, I, I get it. I, I, I get it, but it doesn't actually, it doesn't work with the corn that we have. We want true corn, none of that filthy, oil-tainted, inedible fuel corn. Yeah, gross, we want true corn. Wheat? I mean, I could get more wheat, I don't know. Water well? Oh, uh, we're gonna reroll. Um, grapes, hello? Corn? I mean, you know what we're getting, but we gotta look at other stuff too. You know what we're gonna get, the corn, but we gotta look. Silo. Uh, two times production and two times water cost to wheats in the range of one island. So you put this... And it will f it will double production and water cost of wheats. Then it's all types of wheats, I think. Okay, that could be useful. So it, uh, you, I'm learning. There's like you have to plan out, to like have a central island of where the silo is gonna go when you get it, and then plan the wheat around it. Okay, it's very much a game where like this this is the rogue like meta where I learn like okay, I'm already thinking when I do my next run, I need to go back and I need to design it. I should I I need to play for an empty island here for the silo and put wheat around it, and then over here go a few tiles over and these will be my corn section and you can plan it all out. Uh, this is why I love ro roguelike games. Like my brain is just designed for like I want to play the first two hours of the game over and over and over again, getting better, better, better. I was a speed runner in a different life, I'm sure. Um, of short games. Grapes, though. Cross some water, gives grapes. All right. You would think that the USA would like oily corn. <laughs> Don't sell water egg, it hatches the water, you just read it. Oh, sorry. Right, right. Corn, bam, done. And over here, don't sell the water egg, it hatches into water. Uh, you're right, so we can get more water out of that. I mean, I've got two or something like water, but like, it doesn't sell for very much money, I'm fine. We'll save them up. Oh, uh, let's see. Wheat, corn, milk. The corn is powerful. The synergy is insane. Fuel wheat. Give me more fuel. Well, I am. Well, we got a lot of it. And blue wheat can go down here. Maybe I can fit a silo down here, actually. I'm not sure how big they are. Blue wheat over there, in case I ever get those chickens. And that is our turn. Ta-da. We are incredibly wealthy. Corn might be overpowered. Unless that, unless that money starts scaling real quick, corn's going to be stupid overpowered. Give me all that corn. Thank you. Oh, the value. We want this one to be the center island, I think. So that way, they're like maybe there's like a double value going on of this... Um, like once I get this full 16 and these get a plus 10 bonus for not only that island, but also this island, maybe something like that. And blue wheat goes over yonder and we sell our incredible wealth and wheat, corn, milk, get them out of here and we ride. Hello, what a great day to charge taxes. Your month debt is 300 gold. Can I just pay it all off right now? Is there an option to pay my debt early? It is scaling a lot. That's 900 gold. Ooh, essence reward. Choose a new passive to your farm. Dealer's hand. Um, is that this one? No, dealer's hand. Plus two hand size, but every card is 50% more expensive. Considering how extraordinarily wealthy I am, that is not a big deal. Uh, hmm, popcorn. Every animal, what happens if I run out of cards? Just don't draw anything? Hmm, popcorn. Every animal can eat popcorn as primary food, and if done so, it gets four times production. So if I learn to make popcorn and feed my animals popcorn, which I do have a lot of corn, then they quadruple their animal production, which means more water and more milk, which is good. Home sweet home. Uh, double the slot to all structures. So that means I can fit double the amount of animals in the farm. So I've got extra space I'm sitting on. Um, plus two to hand size. I mean, I kind of want to do plus two to hand size because the money's not an issue and I can put down more corn faster. But I know you guys, you guys, you guys are definitely going to make me pick popcorn, right, chat? Chat, let me know. 
one in chat if you want popcorn, two in chat if you want dealer's hand. Um, or just say popcorn if you want popcorn. I imagine you guys want me to get this. I can't use it right away because I don't have the ability to make popcorn, but we're gonna get popcorn eventually, I'm sure, right? I'm not seeing anybody typing anything in chat. Uh, middle? So I got one person saying the middle. Right, I'm gonna do a count of ten. I got one, Melex, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, we got one for middle. We got one for corn. We got another for corn. We got another for middle. We got another for corn. We got dealer's hand. Uh, it's 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 fifty fifty down the middle. It's actually surprisingly fifty fifty, which means I'm doing what I want. Dealer's hand, baby, let's go. Because that'll if I'm drawing seven cars per turn, that's more chances to draw corn and put corn down as opposed to like like build for popcorn that I don't even have the ability to make yet. All right, I'm surprised. It was fifty fifty. I thought you were all gonna say popcorn. Oh, wheat, four hundred fifty eight corn. Give me that milk. There we go. And now we draw seven. Oh, seven cards a turn. I th do you actually run out of the cards, or is it just kind of like you're adding to a deck that gets recycled? Might be adding to a deck. Watery tree. Ooh, my water's not looking great. Wait, why do I have minus five energy? I'm confused. Why do I have minus five energy? I don't understand that. Uh, watery tree. Uh, minus one water cost on all crops on adjacent islands. Ooh. Produces water equivalent to the total production of the crops on the same island. Oh, okay, that's that's a great water making thing. So I don't want it near the corn because it'll mess up. The, like the corn needs to be a full 16 on it to get the value. So I can't put it on the corn. I could put it. Um, it costs 50 gold. It's not a big deal. I could put it so it's um, minus one water cost on all crops in Jason Islands. I could put it like on here and make these cost less water and these cost less water. That'll help my water situation a little bit. I could do fuel corn, which you don't need. We already decided we don't really want that. I could do beans. We could do beans. Plus one production and plus one water cost to crops in the same island. It gives cost five water, it gives beans. So they cost a lot of water. They probably sell for a lot of money. It costs one production and one water to crops in the same island. So wait a second. So you put a bunch of beans on the same island. That's going to make and they make each other cost more. You're going to end up having like, a, like each single one of these is going to cost 21 water. Is it best to put beans like on an island that has no other crops? I'm confused. Beans seem you lose energy because of nine blue. I don't I don't know about these beans, man. I feel like these are going to like I'm already I'm already in a, a neg. I'm at a, I'm in a water deficit and these seem like they're going to cost a billion kajillion water. Like, they cost five water by default, and for every extra one I put down, how many do I get? I get four. If I put all four together, they each cost nine water, times four is 36. Just alone on themselves in an island is 36 water a turn. I'm already losing negative 13. We might have to come back to beans later. I, 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 I know you guys want beans. I understand your desire for beans. We're going to have to circle back to beans when I, when I have a surplus water situation, which means water tree. We have to get the water tree for now. We'll come back to beans once we can actually uh, afford their absorbent water pricing. But for now, we have corn, baby. Give me all that sweet, sweet, juicy, delectable corn. I need more corn in my life. I need all the corn in my life. Blue wheat. Blue wheat going over here. Why are you like dice space? You weird. I guess it did. Fuel wheat down here. There we go. And we sell all the corn. We are drowning in exorbitant wealth. I could just get more water wells if I didn't see and this we thought water chickens were overpowered apparently not because uh like we because we thought they would save us not having to pay the 10 gold a turn mains cost 10 gold a turn mains cost is nothing in this game I'm learning you do run out of cards so that's good to know you do run out of cards we only drew two cards a turn I think right or am I tripping wait why do you cost 75 because we made them cost more minus one water costs and all crops on adjacent islands so I put this here how much does corn cost for water it was two right um, so I could make you cost four, eight, twelve. That's I could save sixteen there. But if I put it here, that's three, six, nine, twelve. I actually save more over there. Um, uh, produces water equivalent to the total production of the crops. Wait, I could get wait produces water equivalent to the total production of the crops. These things have insane production. I need it. I need it next to these guys. I need it next to these guys. But you're in the way. And I can't destroy. I could get way, I could make more water over there. I could put a new island here 
and ooh, 178, and then have this thing put on the island, and it will get a ton, a ton of production. And then we just expand, instead of putting corn there, extend our corn out this way. I, I, I feel, but the thing is, I kind of want to, wherever I'm not going to put corn in the future, I should put this. Your blue weeds are dying basically because lack of electricity. Ew, okay. Oh, why is it negative three electricity now? I don't get it. So, if I put, am I not growing blue weeds? Because I'm not getting it. If I, where do I want to put my next corn at? If, if my next corn island should probably go here, that way it gets the value of triggering that and that. Which means I can do the water thing up here. We'll do this up here. We'll put you right here. And then you'll, only 16? I thought it's based on their production. I guess it doesn't factor in that this getting these are getting plus 10. I'm so confused. Water tree, you, you, you confuse me. Where are you at, water tree? And why do you deceive me? Produces water equivalent to the total production of the crops in the same island. It must mean the production before all their all their bonuses are factored in. So there's 16 crops, there's 16 production, and then it's not counting in the fact that they get bonuses for having all of them on the same island. And them, it's before all the bonuses. Bummer, disappointment. I I wanted to get like 200 water a turn. Well, now we know. We know for the future it that water tree goes on before all their bonuses go in. Noted. Noted. Fine. That is so... We have so much fuel. Holy crap. Wait, I have 810 fuel. Why am I saving the fuel wheat if I'm already getting the, the, the fuel there? What's the purpose of the fuel wheat? I don't get it. Should I sell it? Blue wheat's only... There's just some flowers. Uh, no, no, yeah, yeah. The blue wheat, I feed the chickens to make that, but I don't have anything. We have no cards here, so we need to get more cards. Perhaps I picked the wrong thing. Seven cows. A um, uh, pasteurizer. Cost 30 energy, don't have energy, so repairs 25 gold. Wait a second, this thing, 30 energy. Oh, oh, it breaks occasionally. 30 energy to power it. Occasionally it breaks, you gotta pay to fix it. It turns milk into uh, pasteurized milk, I guess. Um, but I don't, uh, I don't have energy yet. Uh, mill. Cost 20 fuel. Repairs 20 gold. It turns wheat into whatever this is, flour. We can eat, we, we can do that, we can value that. Or I can re-roll. Do we re-roll? Mmm, I mean, I kind of want to see what happens. Let's make a mill. Let's make a mill. And uh, we can so sell this stuff here. In our turn. There we go. Mill! 20 gold maintenance, 20, 20 fuel maintenance, that's fine. And I don't think, I don't think you need to... What, why is it all blue? Why is it all blue and weird looking? Oh, because it has a range of effect. So put it near the wheat. We'll put it... Yeah, it's got a range that we're only... Fits to a certain range. Well, you can, you can go right here. That'll be fine. There we go. And you... What, do you, what did you do, Mr. Mill? Mr. Mill, what did you do? You turned wheat into something. So it turns all the different kinds of wheat into something. Great. Do I need to manually do it? Or is it just do it? Well, let's just sell all this. Find out. End our turn. It just does it to all of it. Here's the concern. Did my cows actually get fed? They did, I got milk. So it turns it all into flour. Um, hopefully when I get my chickens in, they'll prioritize the chickens instead of that, but I got flour now. I get, I get, I guess the, I get the flour sells for higher price. I mean, it does prioritize because the wheat did go. I think the game's smart enough that it like prioritizes where to send things to. It'll like prioritize, this wheat needs to go to these cows first and the surplus goes to this thing. It's smart like that. All right, so wheat into flour, gotcha. And my water situation's still not great. Mm, nothing to do with this turn. We uh, keep it going. I'm crazy rich, 18,000. We're very well. The mill also affects beans. That's what that kind of wants. Okay. Medium fences, two of them. I can hold more animals. I mean, I if I get chickens eventually, I might need that. Here's the chickens we need. Um, 11 of them. I'll need those extra slots eventually, but for now, give me these chickens. And we go. Seven chickens incoming. You cost water. Which you gotta, I need more water soon. I really do. Adjacent to blue, if, if adjacent to blue wheat uses energy instead of water. So I need to have you be adjacent to these guys. Well, first of all, let's buy this because I'm extraordinarily wealthy. I need you guys to be adjacent, which means I need to not put these guys down until I get a farm. So I forgot about that. So I think we just ignore these guys until I get, a, I, I, I need to put them down here. I, I can't like, um, I can't put them down here. Uh, yeah, we're gonna, I'm going to wait until I draw like a fence. Put the fence in here. 
put them in here. That way they can actually start using this. I didn't realize I had that fence needed to go down there. All right, fine. Well, we're just going to be chilling with some these guys for a while. I'm just selling our, my extreme wealth. Just incredibly wealthy. Fuel cow. Produces fuel equipment to have the total of fuel. I've got plenty of fuel for now. Rabbit. Plus two production and plus one water cost every carrot. So the rabbit synergize with carrots. So it's definitely like you go for like certain builds. I'm not go for that. Beans. Plus one production, plus one water cost across the same island. Fun, but right now I need to get fences. We need to reroll for fences. I could get more or water chickens to ooh, electric carrot. Cool. Um, but uh, let's go for chick water chickens. I, I got a water problem right now. I've got a water problem right now, and we need we need we need these. We need water chickens to solve my water problem. 900 bucks, not a problem. 2700! Whoa! Inflation, it's crazy. Alright, we need to uh, sell this stuff. I mean, I make that in almost a day. It's about to get real expensive, though, I think. Uh, I don't need chickens so much, per se. Sell all this. And we go again. I need to draw my water chickens, yes. Water chicken can go here. Thank you. Water chicken can go here. Thank you. Now we're doing better on the water situation. That's fantastic. Keep selling this stuff. At least this is supposed to turn into... If I hatch those, I need some way to hatch them, right? Hey, new card. Melter Blue Wheat Fisherman's Hut. What do you do? Gives 10 fish plus 10 pressure for each ad ad uh, for each empty adjacent space or adjacent lake. Okay. I think I want to re-roll for uh, like a little storage thing, though. Medium fences. Only one, but I'll take it. Hold 16 slots, we take this. Because I only have so many rerolls. I need the chickens to go down there once I... There we go. Medium fence. Oh, it's a bit bigger, huh? Looks the only thing that can... How do you fit a big fence anywhere if the medium takes the entire slot, right? And now these chickens will go over here next to the... Wait. No. <laughs> no! Where'd my blue wheat... My blue wheat died. Where'd my blue wheat go? Your blue wheat can die? Crap. All right, fine. Whenever I get blue wheat again, I'll... I'll put it over there or something like that. All right, water, egg, go there. That's the fuel wheat, not the blue wheat. The blue wheat just straight up died. I didn't know that could happen. Like I said, I have the electricity to fuel it. All right, well, fine. Chickens, go here. That's fine. I'm a fool and a doofus, but welcome to being a content creator. Embarrass yourself in front of everybody and show how dumb you are. And keep on going, baby. All right, got lots of chicken. They're going to give me lots of uh, eggs and stuff. Great. All right. All right, we keep cooking. That's fine. We all we care about is corn anyway. I got enough chickens. Giant carrot, 500 smackers. Plus one production for every carrot produced in a two-island range. If you're going for a carrot build, which I'm not, you go for that soy. If adjacent to cow, it eats it, giving no bonus. Plus seven water. So... If you put it next to a cow, the cow will eat the soy, and the cow gives no bonus. So if you want to deactivate your cows, you put soy next to them. But I don't want to deactivate my cows. I like the milk, right? So we don't want you to, we don't want this. Uh, I'm a reroll. Oh, you just pay to reroll. Oh, that's good to know. More medium fences could be good. Silo though doubles production and water cost to wheat in the range of island. I don't know that I need more wheat. Rabbits, medium fences. We'll need those fences eventually. We'll just get those. We'll just get those. I'm not sure where I want to put them. For now, I can just keep drawing them in my hand. It doesn't really matter. I've got. I don't have enough things to spend. So. Drawing seven per turn irrelevant when you burn through your, all your cards, right? All right, corn, baby. Blue, uh, but we got the blue wheat. We got the blue wheat, right? We we put all this work to make the blue wheat happen. It fed to a chicken. It gives an electric egg and forty energy. Yes, give me the blue wheat. Thank you. And we're gonna do it up here, I guess. Those are getting expensive. You go here. Ta da. Do on these twenty seven hundred eight thousand. It's getting pricey. Oh boy. It's designed to be as much expensive. Uh oh, essence reward, okay. Rabbit apprentices. If two animals of the same group are on the same island, uh, which I do have here and here, oh, this, oh, oh the same group. Wait. Oh, like two different types of chickens? Uh, get a card of the cheapest animal of that group. It's not that big deal. It just gives you like a free rabbit card or a free chicken card. It's like whatever. Unless it's every turn. Every animal can get can eat popcorn. This one again. I have yet to get a card that helps me make popcorn, unless that Melter does that. Elite cows plus ten production to cows, and double value for items. Are we cowboys? I think we're cowboys up in here. There's no point in saving the fuel. 
We there is none. Okay, somebody told me to. Uh, so I was doing it that way. Get ten times the milk and double value for uh, for items produced by cows. Yeah, yeah. Elite cows, baby. I got some cows here. So we are going to do. Wait. Oh, I was supposed to do it. No, the blue wheat goes over here. I'm do. All right, blue wheat over here. Blue wheat here, and then you should affect those chickens to give energy. My 17, but you're supposed to make them. Unless I need energy first. Don't know. Is there any point to saving the water eggs? I think it's the water eggs are ha hatching. Fuel wheat. Doot, 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 doot. Close. Please don't die, blue wheat. Didn't die yet. I'm still at negative 17 energy. Can't help but notice. Blue wheat, how do you work? Blue, wor blue wheat. If fed to a chicken, it gives an electric egg and 40 energy. I don't think it got fed to the chicken. Cross energy, it gives blue wheat. Where my chickens at? If adjacent to wine. If adjacent to blue wheat instead of energy. Uh, wait, if adjacent to blue wheat uses energy instead of water. So that's why I'm using energy. Because the chickens are next to that. So I don't know that's, I don't know that's a good thing. Uh, how am I supposed to feed these guys? I don't understand how blue wheat works. If fed to a chicken, why didn't... Should they not have eaten it? It gives an electric egg and 40 energy. I don't... Do I have electric eggs? Like, you're next to chickens. Why would you not feed the chickens? It's just not prioritized? Uh, I don't get it. I don't... I don't understand. Whatever. It needs electricity. Do I need electricity? Oh, I need... So I need... Uh, it gives you electricity, but you first need electricity to fuel it. Well, that's a problem. So it's just gonna die when it's not electricity. Alright, well... I need... So to make the blue wheat... You don't... So don't buy blue wheat until you have... Like this, to fuel it, I guess. Produces two energy per thing on adjacent islands. Maybe this is how I make my, my, my energy. Maybe you're right? Sure. Antenna. Please don't die before I get it. Please don't die. They're not dying. Maybe they take time to die. How did these blue wheat up here die? These, I guess it takes time for them to die? I don't get it. Alright, so you produce energy for adjacent things. So put you somewhere where there's a lot of adjacent things. So here you get 16. Here you get a lot more. So you want to have an island in the middle that's kind of, kind of like blank. So these little partial ones are actually good like that. So boom, bam -o. 48 energy coming in. So either sunflowers or this gives me energy. We're cooking and we keep selling our extraordinary wealth. Are these water eggs hatching or do you need to find a way to make them hatch? Am I even able to hatch them from the market? I don't know. How much milk am I getting here? I mean, 44. I mean, it's a little bit more, right? Electric egg. Do I save electric eggs as well? I don't know. Let's just get rid of all this. Got some blue extra saved there. Hang on to them for now, I suppose. And that's all we do for our turn. Yeet. All right, so note to sell five uh, cards is fine. Blue wheat. I don't need more blue wheat. Some of the extra blue wheat's just being saved. I need more chickens to eat the blue wheat. Or I could try soy. Let's just get give me, give me, give me, give me chickens. Give me those chickens. I want to. I got I got all these fences. They need they need using. Give me. Give me the chicken army, the chicken army to use up all the blue wheat, because I got lots of it. And I guess we could put another another one over here next to these guys, right? That one fence we got chilling there. We do this right here, getting pricey. Sell all of this stuff over here. Great. And we go. And give me the medium tile there. And all the chickens over here will also cost energy to maintain as opposed to water. Because they're next to the blue wheat. And they'll eat the blue wheat and give me uh, uh, electric eggs. Yeah, I guess. We are so wealthy. I might... this. I feel like this is a run that could go for two hours. I might just have to be like, <laughs> GG fun game at some point. <laughs> I don't think we're going to lose this one. I don't want to sit here for two hours. I got other games to play, right? Um, fuel tank. Repair 40 gold gives 20 fuel. Nah, I think we're fine there. Water chickens, we're fine on water. Wheats, I think we're good. Reel for something more interesting. Centrifuge! Cost 50 energy. I don't have enough energy for that yet. Repair 50 gold. It processes things. I don't have enough energy income for it. Peanuts! We can make peanut cows. Turns adjacent, adjacent island cow into peanut cow. Do I even have room to put that down for the cows? I do, actually. Peanut cows, boys! Peanut... But beans! <laughs> you thought I would ignore the beans. You thought wrong. 38 gold. Plus one to production, and plus one to water cost of crops in the same island. Okay, so let's put it right here. And, well, first of all, um, these things currently cost one water. And give two fuel wheat each. 
I, I put this on there, like so. They now cost two water each and give one more fuel with each. So I just, by putting that down there, I just increased my water consumption by four, eight, 10, 15. And I put this on there. I'm down to, it, it, these things gobble up water like nobody's business. But we're doing it. We're going, go crazy in that. Now we're gonna be drowning in fuel weight. Great. Holy crap, that's expensive. All right. And you know what? I think the video's long enough. We get the idea what the game is about. I really like it. But we're gonna, I'm just going to like go ahead and like lose on purpose here, not selling anything. Yeah, cool. Just see what it's like when you lose, because I feel like I could easily sit here for like another hour to play this, but I got other games to play. Let's just check out. Sure, yep, that's fine. Yep, whatever. And go ahead and go through our, burn through all our money. Great, pay our debts. Cool, going wide. Cool, sure. And I just want to see what happens when you lose. I think we've already seen that, but like for the video, right? And yep, pay the debts. Man, I was doing real good. Not even trying over here and just lasting forever. And I'm not sure if it goes indefinitely or we lose, but okay, can't afford to pay. Give me our reward. Uh oh, no, we lose this turn. And it's just a little game over. And then you go back to their start. Okay, cool. I like it. Super fun game. I had a great time. And uh, I think there's a demo that's free on Steam. Link in the description down below. Thanks for watching. And that's all I got. See you next time.